All right, Irish mothers, we all know them. We all love them. They are a different kind of human. Irish mammies are no ordinary mothers. In fact, they're fucking crazy. <laughs> Let's go. Can I tell you something? Go on. I'm after getting a girl pregnant. I did. You better fuck off. Michael, you better fuck right off. I did, like. Well, go down and live with her. What are you on about? Because uh, I have nothing to do with it. You're too young. Go down and find that tramp. You better fuck right off, Michael. You serious? I'm deadly serious. You're far too fucking young for that shit. Go away, will ya? I will ya. What are you going to do? Go to school and mind your child. You can mind your child. I'm going to be fucked. The only thing I'll be minding is your red arse after I've absolutely baiting the shit out of it with a wooden spoon. Getting a girl pregnant at the age of a, like something like 11 is not going to go down with any mother. But to an Irish mother, any little grievance of you acting like an idiot is going to be met with the same fury. Like one thing's for sure, you do not leave an exam early, otherwise... Don't go off the head. What? Well, I have been the exam for about an hour and... Well, an hour and a half and I left. Why did you do that one? Because I couldn't figure out that. Like, I was f***ed after it. I couldn't, like, do what it What did all. I tell you, Owen? That you don't leave an exam, you can f***ing stick with it. Now, Owen, I love you and everything, but you're meant to stick with an exam till the bitter end, you little sh- Why would you leave an exam, Owen? I sure I couldn't. Owen. I didn't understand half of it. Like, I don't know Are you that f***ing? Stupid, are you? I can't believe that someone that flew out my flaps could be such a fruitcake. But look, when it comes to Irish mammies, it's all about tough love. They will be you. They will make you feel like you are a little worm. But at the end of the day, even if you're still an idiot, they probably still love you and will offer you some ice cream. You didn't understand half of it. You want some ice cream or don't you? No. But look, we all know it's pretty fun to actually push the buttons and see what kind of reaction we can get out of our mums. But sometimes you can push it way too far. If you're going to push them that far, be prepared. There are a lot of things that make Irish mammies quite unique, but most importantly are certain key phrases. Dara, a letter came in for you from the post today. Do you want me to open it? Jesus, you weren't down at that clinic for your willy, were you? Seems like you got away with it this time. You don't have crabs. If I've told you once, I've told you a thousand times, you better wrap it up. I have eyes in the back of my head, you know. I know when you're off gallivanting. When I was your age, we were outside playing with twigs, not fiddling with each other's bits. Now eat up the rest of your dinner there. And remember, <coughs> the best form of contraception is just say no. And for the most part, all those phrases and insults are only directed at you in your own home, except for one other little exception. The Late Late Show. No, not that one with James Gordon but our very own one. Hosted by someone named Ryan Tuberty, AKA me, apparently. Yeah, me. No Irish mammy in their right mind would miss the Late Late Show. Even if they don't like it, they will watch it. The thing is, a lot of them like to hate it. That was N shite. Hashtag Late Late, hashtag Late Late Show. The absolute biggest steaming pile of shite ever to grace my very old TV. Hashtag Late Late Show. What in the f Hashtag Late Late Show. I've heard some shit music in my time, but this is atrocious. Hashtag late late show. Oh dear, bit of a lip sync wobble there. Hashtag late late. Hashtag late late show. I'm out. I've reached maximum Sir Michael levels done with this shite. I'm off to binge watch Derry Girls. Hashtag late late show. Hashtag late late. How the actual F is this show still going? Milking it. I know violence doesn't solve violence, but I sincerely hope that guy gets his head caved in. Screaming orphans were utterly brutal. My daughter's TikTok videos were more professional. Hashtag late late show, hashtag late late. Don't forget the taxpayer paid for that awful bit of miming on the hashtag late late show. WTF was that cover. Hashtag autotune, hashtag late late show. The cores are looking rough, hashtag late late show. What in the name of Jesus is going on tonight on the hashtag late late show? Bobby giving it socks. All right, that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you big up the like button, subscribe, press the button, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.